If you have a homie next to you, then go give him a big fat hug and celebrate because we managed to save a wooly, gamers. He was too much of a bro to die just like that. No, I'm not still in denial, you jerk. I have undeniable proof that he is alive because of us. Let me explain how we did the most gaga chat thing in Amanda history. It all starts at the butcher shop. Amanda is telling us to type in meat. Wooly, on the other hand, keeps shaking his head and hands, telling us not to do it because it will likely kill him. And no way am I letting that happen. So instead of that, we type in lamb, hoping that it could ironically save him because he is a sheep. Then the secret tape suddenly appear when it wasn't there before, but we don't know how. What we do know is that it doesn't appear if we just listened to Amanda and typed in meat without typing lamb. So Amanda definitely didn't give the tape to us. Since it only hinders her plan and pisses her off, which thank god cause fuck her. It has to be someone else, I don't know who, maybe Kissing Missy from Poppy Playtime? But the new tape helps us understand what this mysterious person is trying to do. The first two clips of the tapes are seemingly random. It's impossible to really say what they mean without more context. It's like two pieces of a much bigger jigsaw puzzle. The third clip, however, is very relevant because it shows a lot of poor carcasses and it forces you to type in Wooly, which ends the tape and makes you exit without ejecting itself and disappearing inside the TV, letting you go to the third tape. Now, who do we know that has the power to force us to type something against our will? It's Amanda. She must have noticed that we were watching the secret tape that a mysterious being left us when we got to the third clip. Being angry at this, she forces us to type the code Wooly, which she knows will end the tape and even making it disappear. We know this because typing in Wooly on the first or second clip will also end the tape early, so it's entirely possible that there are more than just the three clips we've seen and seeing how Amanda doesn't want us to see more, it must be something she's hiding, maybe her weakness. She must have been being herself thinking we might have found out her secret. If we saw more, then maybe the first two clips would make sense. But the really important clue to how I know Wooly was saved is that the third clip was an image of pork carcasses and not lamb, even though they do look similar. And this sends a very clear message that it's not Wooly. So from all of this information, we can piece together a little bit of what happened. Typing lamb at the butchers must have activated some kind of guardian angel that swooped in and saved Wooly right before Amanda got to him. This guardian angel then tries to reveal Amanda's secrets that she doesn't want us to see as well as telling us that Wooly is safe now by showing us poor carcasses instead of lamb. Sadly, before we could find out more information, Amanda noticed and forced the tape to end and vanished to get rid of the evidence. So there's basically two endings. The one where you don't wake up the guardian angel and Wooly dies, or the one where you type in lamb at the butcher's shop, which wakes up our mysterious hero saving Wooly from his tragic death. I really like this theory because it explains almost everything about the secret tape, from how the tape could appear and why it shows the poor carcasses instead of lamb, and finally to being forced to type wooly and then the tape disappearing. Tell me what you think about this theory. Like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.